Hi, this is Nathan, your neighborhood arcade and pinball talk guy. We're going to be reviewing Lost World by Bally today. Hold her solid state table. Uh, please look for a review underneath the description of our YouTube video. Uh, there you'll find all the metrics of our review written out for easy reading. Uh, please follow us, Arcade and Pinball Talk, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, as well as click that red subscribe button. If you like mechanical pinball, if you like virtual pinball, if you like arcade, hell, if you like anything that has to do with pinball, just go ahead, join our family, click, click subscribe now. Let's go ahead and get this review underway, shall we? Oh no, it's a, it's, this table right here has some different LEDs in it which allow it to look a lot different. And I gotta say, I do like the, the visuals of this machine the way that it is set up at this moment. Uh, wider flipper gap on this thing, but all in all, back glass looks good. Uh, it's mirrored. Uh, art looks good for what you would expect from an older uh, table. It is a banger and a clanger. No real soundtrack, but you do have some, some clings and stuff like that going on in it. Table set up to flow a little bit better than some of the other ones that I've played, just because of the way that you have the lanes to the left and your capture ball target to the right. So let's jump into table mechanics. Flipper gap is pretty pretty uh, wide. In lane to the left and right. Out lane to the left and right. You have targets to the left, kick out to the left of that. You have a spinner with a lane going around which comes down to your comms. Mushroom bumpers to the center. You have a captive ball with a target to the right side, dragging in, and a kick out to the right with some targets to the below that. Very simple setup, but again, smooth. And again, with older solid state tables, obviously they're not, le they're not elevated very high they're more flat so something to keep in mind here so our works there for this table I think theme is there the banging and clanging I actually like it high ball out on this table as well uh, replayability is gonna be there as well on this table I just like the way it looks and the way it's playing right now the flippers feel good the coils are firing right I like the capture ball to the top right A little bit of a slow player as you can see the ball speed on it's a little slower so it's more it's just a moderate difficulty i wouldn't even say it's it's super hard it's just more high ball out due to the way that the lanes are and, and the angles of where they're firing back at you and then also the the angle of the flippers is almost pointing straight down so that does throw your shot off a little bit unlike traditional flippers and as you can see there without double flipping i would have been done just coming off that that rail there Good blocks in the middle with those mushroom bumpers, and that's what they're intended to do, is to keep you from getting to those columns to the back. Great looking table. I'm liking the mods on this with the light colors. It looks really cool. That's something that you could do with these older tables, is kind of fix them up with these light mods, or pin stadiums, or, or whatnot, and just make them kind of pop a little bit different than what they normally do. And it just kind of adds a little a, a different dimension to it. It's almost like making the table new again. But all in all, Lost World Ballet, great table. Look for our review underneath the description of our video. You'll find all of our metrics there. Click Show Me More, or click the down arrow underneath the headline. You'll see it pop open there. Uh, beyond that, please click Subscribe. Join our family. Thank you again for watching. Until next time.